Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be making hibachi fried rice. I've already washed my zucchini and onion and now I'll be cutting them into slices. Now I'm gonna cut one whole sweet yellow onion into strips. Um, you can really cut it however you want to, but this is how I do it. You can substitute any of these ingredients if you like, but I do have steamed broccoli, steamed peas and carrots, salted butter, onion, zucchini, shrimp, white rice, garlic salt, soy sauce, white sauce, and egg. You're gonna start off by adding one tablespoon of olive oil to your griddle or your pan and just move it around. Then you're gonna add your bowl of cooked rice. You're gonna wanna cook your rice a day before so it should sit in the refrigerator um, overnight. I'll be adding four cups of cooked rice to the griddle and then I'm gonna just spread it apart so that it covers the entire griddle. Now you're gonna add two tablespoons of butter to your rice, and then you're gonna add one to two teaspoons of garlic salt, and just sprinkle all over it. You don't wanna put too much because the soy sauce is salty enough. Now I'm going to add one fourth cup of peas and carrots that have been steamed already. I'm just gonna sprinkle them over top of the rice and then I'm gonna fold them in. Now I'm gonna add two to three tablespoons of soy sauce. I'm just gonna drizzle it on top and save the rest for my vegetables.
you're gonna keep flipping and mixing it all in until it gets a light brown color to it just like that so it's looking good keep flipping and keep mixing now i'm going to add two beaten eggs it is optional of course just like any of the other ingredients but after i fry them hard i'm going to add them to my fried rice push all of my fried rice to one side and then add my other ingredients to begin cooking those. I'm going to add my one sweet onion and one zucchini and start frying those to two teaspoons of soy sauce to my vegetables. Now I'm adding a tablespoon of butter to my vegetables, which is gonna allow it to break down quickly. That's how our vegetables should look. They should have a slight browning to them. Um, you don't want to cook them too long or they'll get soft. I love my vegetables a little bit crunchy, so about five minutes is long enough. Now I'm going to add my steamed broccoli to the griddle as well as my shrimp. My broccoli has been pre-cooked, so this is just to give it like a nice grill look to them. broccoli as well as my shrimp. Listen to the sizzle y'all. It sounds so good. It smells so good. This is how everything should look. There should be a lot of color in your vegetables. Everything looks good. Right now I'm adding my teriyaki sauce to my shrimp, which will just give it a little glaze. All right, 
right y'all that's all to it um everything looks good if you need the full ingredients or directions i'll put it in the comments below just let me know if you make it if you like it let me know like comment subscribe and stay tuned for more videos thanks